and here you can see that we have to make this now let's add a two section layout okay like this here we can uh, rename this hero and here we can have uh, one uh, four zero zero let me check the width and all okay so here we can use one three zero zero max width like this okay and here we can have 80 to the top and 80 to the bottom here we can have we can remove all of these paddings from here okay <clears throat> then we can go to this here we have to use a background image so let's go to the media library and here we will find this one like this here uh, we have this option for the center center and center and here we have the display size will be covered okay and here you can see that uh, if i go to this and here we can have uh, the easy way okay and here you can choose your fonts according to let's make this white here let's uh, make this 20 okay then after that we have this so for that also we can have this uh, okay and here we can just uh, copy this text here and we can go here okay like this and uh, here if i go let's increase the font size of this okay we can use this 80 80 is looking very big so let's use the 70 per pixel and uh, this we have to break okay for breaking we can use a dr tag and here you can see that we have dream of different colors so for that we're going to use some custom okay so you can make this in any other way also okay and here we can add uh, okay here we can add span tag not style okay here we can add this span tag and inside this we can use the style and here we can use the color okay so the color which we're gonna use is uh, i think zero zero double b double f so we can just go here and here we can write uh, zero zero double b double f like this also and rest color we're gonna make this to white okay so we have this uh, ready okay then after that uh, we have to just uh, add here a text editor and this will say this okay let's add this and here also we can make this completely white okay and let's increase the font size of this also like this okay let's publish this one so we don't lose any changes so now you can see that we have this uh, so we have, for that we can add a container and here we can remove all of this now we can add a button here and here we have the register now so we can just click on this register now and here we can have this transparent and this we can make this white here we have the solid and this also we can make this fully white here we can have the 15 okay like this and here we can go to this here we can have the hover effect and make this white like this border color would be this also and here we can have some hover animation like grow okay so in this way now you can see we have this button so this is very easy you have to just uh, choose the icon widget here and just drag and drop this now go to this container which is the parent container of both this and make this like this okay and here we can upload svg can upload this also or you can go from this and choose for play here we have so much options so let's choose this okay and here we can use this now let's increase its size and all if you want we can make this white like this okay whatever colors you want you just you can make this like this here if you want uh, we can have this more like here we can use 30 for the left also we can use the 30 okay we can make this bigger you can just increase the typography of these fonts like this so it will, it will look it bigger so for that we have to put the space also we can just put uh, go to this parent container advance 
and here we can add 30 pixels so this in this way okay now let's publish now we have to make this form so for that form we can add a new container here like this and here we can name this uh, form box okay now we can have this uh, now let's see here we have the hero and here we can just go to the layout we can make everything in the center okay here also we can go to this parent and we can make everything in the center so we have this now we can make this form box completely white okay here we have some border also let's give this border okay uh, now let's have some padding also i think padding is required so let's give 40 now let's inside this you can add a text and this is saying find your perfect fit okay and here we can make this black you can choose our black theme black uh, you can play with the font size uh, let's make this uh, uh, 26 is looking good okay whatever you prefer just make this okay 27 now we have this so for that we can add a form okay you will find this elementary widget form now we don't want the label and first make this medium okay now we can add enter city name select status so let's make this uh, city name and here we can write uh, enter your city okay and here we can write uh, enter your email like this here we don't want this message field then we have the select status so for that we can add this here we can choose this uh, select option and here we can write uh, select uh, what does the name select status okay select status here also we can add this field status a brand so this first field will show here like this then we have this uh, select types also we can just uh, you can just duplicate this and just change this here select type okay and here also we can select this now just to change this options here we can add rent plot apartments and all okay so you can choose well this here <clears throat> then we have a uh, full name and minimum and maximum so for the full name we can use the city name and just uh, we can write this here and here also place this okay and uh, you can see we have this minimum and max so right now you can see that these are the columns side by side so how are we gonna do that for that add a new choose this uh, number field here number okay and here you can see that we can add a min area square feet okay we can just add this a placeholder here okay like this and here we you will find this option 100 so just choose 50 percent now just duplicate and here you will find the max here also you will find this max okay like this go to button here you will find go to the medium and here you will find uh, submit like this okay now let's go to the styles here you will find the button option theme blue okay like this and on the hover also we can use this dark blue like this okay and uh, if you want you can put some animations also all these animations are there bob or sync so all these animations are there i prefer let's use the sync animations like this okay now let's go to the form and here we can add 20 and this would be 20 also then we can go to this field and we can make this completely black okay and here we can have this border width uh, zero border radius also zero and we have to use this color little shade so for this i think we can use the background color but little like this or you can use this theme bg like this okay this is looking good 
we have we can add some border also pg and uh, here you can use this and make this little bit darker okay like this okay so this is looking good i so you can customize it according to you now let's publish this once and here you can see that we have this little bit smaller bit so we can go to this form box go to layout and here just you can make this smaller okay like this okay like this so we can have this border also so this is the form box this is the so let's go to the form box style here you will find border option so we can add the border type uh, solid okay we can add this to five or this something and here also we can add this okay we can add this here we can add the 10 8 like this and we can make this transparent if you want okay like this so i hope this is looking good you can fully customize it whatever you want to make this okay and uh, here we can also have this in the center line like this we can put some more spacing here like this okay so in this way let's publish now if i go to this and preview it from here you can just preview it live you, you can see that we have this now working and i hope this is looking like this so you can just customize all of this look